coffee. <laughs> See ya. Hey guys, we have found it buried here, and I know the camera angle is funny looking right now, but I want to show you how to remove a tick from your animal. A lot of people, they go and buy, I don't know if you can see him right there, but there's the tick. You see that? Just sitting there. He's stuck in the skin right now. But the way I do it, the way I've learned how to do it, and it's probably the safest way, is to try to keep your dog calm for a few minutes. Sometimes it takes a couple minutes. Sometimes it's right away. But I just rub the tick. See the ticks right there? I just rub it back and forth like this. Come on, boys. Just stay still, buddy. Oh, boy. Just keep rubbing it back and forth. Come on, boys. Sorry, I got a runny nose. I'm sniffling a lot. But yeah, I have uh, 30 acres out behind my house. And me and Boris were out there running around all the time. And uh, this time of year, he gets a lot of ticks. And Boris, just stay. Just stay. But yeah, sometimes it takes a few minutes, several minutes. But, uh, yeah. Come on, Boris, just stay. Oh, boy. And, yeah, that uh, skin you see on the back of Boris' neck, that's a birthmark he's had his whole life. It doesn't affect him. It's not mange or anything like that. It's just a birth defect he's had ever since he was a baby. Come on, Boris, you're going to knock my shelf over. Just stay. Oh, boy, just stay. Get the bug. Come on, Boris. Up, up, up. He doesn't like it. Boris, please stay. Come on. Just stay. Just stay. This guy, he won't let go. Oh, Boris, please stay. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Boris. Come on. All right. New position. Just stay. Just stay. Oh, I'm up. Oh, where the hell did it go? There it is. Oh, boy. Just stay. It does take a long time sometimes, but it's so much safer to do it this way, I think. I've never, never had any of my dogs get sick. And trust me, they've all had ticks. This is the second one I pulled out of them today, actually. one thing when you first go out and you come back always check you might be able to get the loose ones out but they're really small before they get full of blood and then always check a couple days after you're out there and then check everywhere especially in the armpit areas and stuff in the warm spots they like them This one, he's in there though, good. Holy.
on board this day. Oh, and I think he fell off. He did. <laughs> Shit, now where the hell did he go? That's the worst. I wasn't paying attention. I lost him. Son of a bitch. All right, well, anyways, you can see it's gone now. You guys probably seen it come out. Now I have to get Boris to move. This is not too likely he'll grab back onto them again because they're so fat and they're hard to hard to move. But okay, Boris, come on up. Come on up. Come on up, Boris. There you go. Look at he looks still so scared still. Alright, you guys, that's how to get rid of a tick. As soon as I find them on my floor, I will show you what they look like. Ugly things. Okay, guys, well, there's the tick. Ugly, aren't they ugly? He's on his back right now, I believe. But that is what weight on branches and stuff when you're going through the forest and they just grab on you and then they suck your blood. But yeah, you guys remember, that's probably the easiest and safest way that I've ever done to take ticks out. And like I said, it works on humans too. I've had them on me. They're, they're a little scary to look at, but that's what they are. And then please make sure you kill them, which I won't do on camera, but you have to kill them because they can kill your animals and other animals. So it's us against them and we <laughs> shall win. There you guys, I just wanted to flip him over. Where the hell did he go? Oh, there he is. Yeah. Yeah, they're kind of, oh, he wasn't flipped over. What the hell's going on with the camera now? Jesus Christ. <laughs> really? There we go. But yeah, as you can see, he still has his head on him, which is the most important part. You don't want that stuck in your animal because he will get Lyme disease and die. <laughs> All right. Found it buried in the back of Boris's neck. Poor Boris. Found it buried out. <laughs>